Uh, ooh, ooh. Mm. All right, so we got a show here. Uh, doing a show, uh, we got California Senator Dianne Feinstein's approval ratings hit an all-time low. Um, good. Good. Fuck her. Good. And well, don't fuck her because she doesn't deserve it. But anyway, let's read. Views of Senator Dianne Feinstein's job performance have tumbled to the lowest point in her three-decade Senate career with just 30% of California voters giving her positive marks on a new UC Berkeley Institute of Governmental Studies poll co-sponsored by the LA Times. And my question is, how on earth is it 30%? Who supports her? Like, who? Like, tell me. I want to speak to these 30% of people in California that apparently support Dianne Feinstein. Why do they support her? Do you remember when Dianne Feinstein hugged Lindsey Graham and said, I'm, I'm so happy to be here for the Amy Coney Barrett fucking hearing? Do you remember that? You know, Dianne Feinstein, yeah, the same senator who was caught in an insider trading scandal profiting off of the COVID-19 pandemic and market crash that happened in March of 2020. She profited off of that. She made millions and millions of dollars because she was in the Senate. She knew how bad the pandemic would be and was going to be. She took her money out and then fucking let the stock market crash. And then she fucking like, you know, got significantly more wealthy because she increased her stock portfolios by dozens and dozens of percentage points. Does anyone remember that? No, apparently. What else happened? How the fuck are the 30% of people that support her after any of those things? Oh, yeah, my senator, uh, you know, she's a great senator. Uh, and uh, so what she did was she knew that there was going to be a pandemic that was going to kill a million people. Um, and instead of telling anyone else about it, she told her family and then they all got their stocks out. They got it. And then two days later, the market crashed, you know, and then uh, and then they bought back in. Right. OK, that's great. Uh, and then also she, you know, she was a staunch supporter of a far right Republican Supreme Court pick. <laughs> the month before the election wasn't it like two three weeks before the election yeah and then she went on tv hugging lindsey graham reminder there's been reports that she literally has dementia like she literally has fucking dementia do we even need to talk about like how like the fucking like was it the sun the sunrise movement or whatever went to her office and she was like do you want a job here kitties <laughs> like and then she like harassed the shit out of teenagers she was like <gasps> You're 16, you can't even vote for me, so I don't get, like, remember that? Does anyone remember that? No, apparently not. 30% of people support her. What? Like, what is, uh, how many people live in California? Like, what is the California, California population? 39 million. 39 million people. What? What? All right, three, nine. Wow. That's like, that's like a million people that would go out there and say, yeah, Diane Feinstein, yeah. I like her. A million, what? 10 million? I don't know, what's 10 million? I don't know, I can't read numbers without commas. Um. I'm also on drugs. But again, what the fuck? I don't even want to read. I'm amazed at the dissatisfaction for both of the women. Why? Oh, because people don't like Kamala Harris either. Okay. 49% of registered voters giving five cents a negative assessment include respondents from core Democratic blocs, those who identify as strongly liberal, voters under 40, and Latinos and Asian Americans in all regions of the state, including the major population centers of LA and the Bay Area, where she is from. A plurality of voters disapprove of her performance. Good. Fuck her. She's garbage. She's garbage. Yes, I'm screaming again. Most striking is Feinstein's loss of popularity among women, women voters. How is that striking? She helped. In the PR battle, she helped a far right anti-abortion fucking person get on the fucking Supreme Court. I wonder why women aren't going to be huge fans of that. I'm just, I'm just wondering when she and former Senator Barbara Boxer became the first female senator from California. Now one third of women surveyed approve of her performance while 42% disapprove for her to be underwater among female voters is a very significant and ominous sign for her. Bitch. She has fucking dementia. She should be retiring. The fact that she's even going to like, 
I, I'm done. Like, I can't even read this. This is making me so frustrated. Like, she's garbage. Anyone that even pretends to support Dianne Feinstein is a son of a bitch and a piece of garbage. And they should probably just consider leaving the country because they're useless fucking piles of garbage. And, you know, they should just consider, like, you know, going to an island somewhere. Find an uninhabited rock in the middle of the Pacific Ocean and just go hang out there. Build a tent and go hang out there, you fucking stupid ass bitch. I don't know what to tell you. If you support Dianne Feinstein, you are a scumbag and a terrible person. Uh, by every metric, there is no redeemable quality to this horrific fucking bitch. I don't know what to tell you. Is that is that my fault? Is that my fault that she profited off of a pandemic that killed a million people? That's not my fault. That's not my. I was not my fault. I didn't tell her, hey, you should profit off of a pandemic that kills a million people. Did I tell her that? No. So fuck her.